Salutations, this is Grim Devel. Welcome back to our Let's Play of RimWorld. So I, uh, this morning, I recorded a very sleepy RimWorld episode, which is not the episode that you're watching. Uh, I had taken a red eye last night from visiting some family back home, and um, I realized after I uploaded the episode that I didn't actually record any video, which is a shame because it, I thought it was a really good episode, uh, besides, despite my being sleepy. Um... And I guess I'll tell you some things that happened in the episode. The first thing that happened was Chio built all of these end tables, and they turned even made she even made a masterwork one, which she only has nine construction skill. Um, but I think already the tables are not as good as they were. But we'll see. Maybe she'll do okay. We were attacked by manhunting wargs, which ended up being kind of crazy. Um, and we were visited by some by a caravan at the same time. We also had a major psychic drone attack for men uh, in Grim Develfia. Uh, and this coupled with a bunch of other stuff. It, it, we ended up basically, um, the wargs ended up actually like um, breaking in for some reason. I think something weird. I tried to have like someone come out to attack them before the caravan got to them. But they ended up breaking in and it ended up being just a huge, a huge fight. Um, but unfortunately, that, that is no longer, that's fake news now. That is not real history. It's alternate history. Uh, but I just thought I'd kind of share that with you, because I'm interested to see if Randy will give us, will give me something similar to, uh, what I ended up, uh, this is why also I don't play Iron Man mode, because stuff like that happens all the time, and I have to reload a game. Anyway, uh, the good news is that stuff that I kind of needed to figure out while I was recording. I've already figured out, like, what we're going to do next. Um, you may notice I got a new monitor. You, not that you, you wouldn't notice that. Uh, I got a new monitor, finally. It was a good... My monitor had broken. You, I was, have been complaining all last week uh, about having to record everything in full screen. I don't have to do that anymore. Uh, the monitor breaking was a good, good timing because it was around Black Friday. So I got a nice new monitor, a good deal. Um, so I don't have those issues anymore. I'm noticing with my new contrast settings, a lot more dirt. I think dirt was always there, but I'm just seeing dirt on my screen a lot more. Just dirt in all these rooms, and it's gross. And I want to try to take care of that a little better. Um, one thing I want to do is, uh, build a barn here in Hardwinter. Uh, somewhere in Hardwinter. Where... where are where did we go? Where are we? There we are. Um, just so the animals stop tracking stuff in, I can I can make a place for animals to to sleep in that's warm. I think we need some wood for that. So I am gonna. We have some trees that are actually fully grown now. I'm gonna spot harvest some of those. We're still working on research. We have a bunch of research benches uh, after last time. Way too many research benches, I think. And it's, it is a shame that you can't move them, but I, I get why. Yeah, a lot of ready-to-harvest poplar trees. I think some oak trees, too. Yeah, there we go. It's got at least one oak. Beautiful. Uh, so we're going to do that. I also, last episode, I had a little uh, zzz, and our geothermal generator caught on fire. And I did catch it in time, but you can't repair it because we don't have the tech. And I also realized that... Um, if there's fire over here, you can't get through through the walls. And these walls, um, what happened is the wall caught fire and then the generator caught fire because of that. I think I want to replace these walls with stone. We have some limestone blocks here. We are making more. Um, if we use some, we'll make more. I think I'm going to start replacing some of these walls those. I, I'm just going to go ahead and replace all of them, actually. And hopefully you're just deconstructing the wall. No, you're deconstructing everything here. Don't deconstruct the power conduit, please. Okay, good. Okay, so we're doing that. And we'll also build a barn. And we can build a barn out of wood. Um, are we out of power? Clearly, they went ahead and Deconstructed a power. Yep, they sure did. Chia, that wasn't cool. I told you not to. I thought I canceled it. Not cool at all. At least we had recently harvested the hydroponics, so none of those hydroponics are going to go bad. But that's annoying. I canceled... I 
I know I knew it messed up and I canceled the mess up. I guess not in time. She was set on doing it. Uh, yeah, so I'm kind of curious to see if Randy will give us some, uh, you know, we'll make stuff happen that's, you know, if there's like a, a counter for like, okay, we're ready for stuff to happen now. I know Randy's not supposed to really be like that, but we'll see. Uh, and we'll put some doors in here. And this will be the barn. And we'll put a heater in here as well. I'll wait for the room to be constructed. I think we have enough power. Right now our grid, we have, even with the light on here, we have uh, 1140 excess on our grid. So that should be fine. I think these heaters are less than 200 watts. Uh, oh, this one's only 18, but I think they get up to more than that when it's colder out. Um, we are, we have plenty of veggies now and meat, so we are actually, Tango's is making pemmican, which is awesome. Um, I think I can turn on this high-tech research bench, because there's no point, if we're not going to deconstruct it, and we already have, you can only have one multi-analyzer per research bench, we'll just have three research benches, why not? Um, oh. Oh, so we did have a zzz, just like my lost episode except it happened right here which is fine that's much better actually uh did we lose any no we didn't lose any um power lines let's see we have mostly limestone so i will make a limestone door and then i will make limestone walls to replace much better and then once those are made, we will be making more stone cutting, uh, stone, more cut stone. That'll be nice. Um, I was wondering because last time I got a major psychic drone and that was really devastating. We have some psychically hypersensitive people and they were getting negative moodlets of like negative 54. It was pretty crazy. Um, so I was hope I was trying to see if maybe now there was a way we have four psychic foil helmets, but, and they are extremely effective. Some of these are almost totally gone though and i thought maybe in 1.0 maybe they made a gave a way to make more but i don't think they did i don't think there is a way to create foil helmets at least not with our current tech also i don't think at least um the uh i don't think any of the other helmets reduce psychic uh effects either just foil helmets i don't know why like realistically we should have the technology to make foil helmets although i guess technically aluminum is not in the game just steel so i guess aluminum is a rare element maybe in this game and you have to trade for it maybe that's it um i also was thinking um i think we need another cleaner i think we have well lopal cleans after wardening Everything's just so dirty. I guess it's fine. We just need people cleaning more. It might be nice to um to floor some of the areas that are indoors now but are dirt. But I think we would rather do that in limestone, but it takes like to do this room it takes over a thousand blocks or um or a thousand resources. And I kind of don't want to do it with wood because that's super flammable and dangerous. Maybe it would be okay if I also put in some partitions, some like, uh, you know, paved tiles as partitions or even concrete, which is ugly. Maybe paved tiles around. Metal tiles. Yeah. I could carpet. I mean, carpet is also flammable. But... It's, uh, what else are we going to do with all of our cloth? I guess we just made some chairs, which was were nice. And I guess we could keep doing that, actually. Because it would still take a lot of cloth. I think I would rather have the chairs, because we can always sell the chairs. Yeah, in fact, let's just keep making these. And then we can deconstruct them also. Uh, well, I'm sorry, not deconstruct. Uninstall them and then sell them when there's a trader. We have a lot of muffalo wool also. Yeah, we might want to make some out of muffalo wool. Pack of wool. After these cloth ones, we'll do that. Because I don't know what else we're going to do with it. We could carpet more, I guess. But I'm not... Uh, yeah. I, 
So yeah, do I do this in wood to floor it all? It would increase this the speed. Um, I've seen on my Discord channel, um, I think, is it Dorkling? Actually, I can check real quick. Um, where's my Discord channel? Someone on my Discord channel. Yeah, Dorkling has been posting um, some pictures of his base, and he's been doing really cool designs with the carpeting. Kind of makes me want to do that as well. And I could, but it is flammable. And also, I'm terrible at design. So, I think we'll do wood. And I will try to keep a path around it. Uh, this is fine. Actually, yeah, we can floor all this. But I'll keep a path, like, here. To prevent spread. And uh, cancel these, too. And we'll do paved tiles. Neutral in terms of looks. That's fine. Yeah. So that should keep fire from spreading, like, out. We still have this wooden wall, but I think that's okay. Because we have stone in between. And I'll, and then once that room is done, I'll do it the same thing in here. In fact, I might as well right now make those paved tiles. We might as well. Yeah. I could also replace some of this, because this is just regular concrete here, and I could make those paved tiles. I probably should. We'll just... Yeah, it'll just do it right over it. Everyone will like it more. Because we have the resources for it at this point. And it'll beautify things a bit. Yeah. Good. I'll keep going. I don't know if it's any faster to walk on. A raid. Okay. Well, okay, so it looks like Randy did have some stuff prepared for us. It just didn't determine what those things were going to be. So this is instead of the man-hunting wargs. This is probably a little more dangerous. Wow! Um, scratch that, a lot more dangerous. The weapons here are kind of mid-tier. I don't see any assault. No, I do see one, two assault rifles. Rifles, some sniper rifles. No, there are definitely a few uh, assault rifles. Hmm. No charge rifles, although I'm not sure raiders have those anymore. We have a minigun. Uh, one thing that I was also uh, started doing after the Manhunter attack in the Lost Game was I wanted to start putting. I uh, know I need to deal with these raiders, obviously, but uh, I want to start putting some wooden shelves um, by some of our. Uh, doors here, um, or kind of nearby, because I want to start making frag grenades and putting them here, because when groups of enemies congregate here, I think it might be really effective to throw frag grenades at them. So I'm going to start doing some of that, putting some of these... Um... Yeah, that's fine. Just putting some of these shells up around some of our entry points near our main base. Uh, and then putting frag grenades on them. And I will... Frag grenades take chem fuel. And I don't think we have a lot of chem fuel here, if any. But we do have some boomalopes. We might not have any female boomalopes. I think we're trying for that. Let's put in a job anyway for frag grenades. Just like a static six. I'm going to put them up here at the top. Uh, below disassemble me mechanoids. That'll be good. Okay. So... Oh, they can't get to that, huh? That's fine. Um, I want to move... I want to... You know what? I think we do want to keep this door open. Uh, when the Manhunter event happened, I had to move that quickly. But I think we do want these folks to come in this way. Uh, yeah. Let's make sure everyone's inside. Uh, our animals... We don't want these huskies to be unrestricted. Let's just keep them to the animal eating for the meantime. Yeah, that'll be good. And the same with our boars down here in Delphacus. Everyone, animal eating. And I'll I'll have the haulers switch back to unrestricted after this. Our people. Uh, nope. Our pe uh, yeah, our people. 
Call into space safety. That's what I want. And this is all squished now because animal areas are in here too. I think after this game, if I can remember, I might want to remove some of these areas since animal and human colonist areas are both all in the same menu now, which is a nice feature. Um, okay. We're going to do that. And are they attacking immediately? I didn't really pay attention. Yeah, they look like they're attacking immediately. Let's get folks in position. Actually, I can look at the messages now, can't I? Oh, you can scroll down here now. Um, maybe you always could. Uh, whoops. There we go. Uh, I want messages. History. Messages. Show messages. Raid. They will prepare for a while. Okay. So they are going to wait a little bit. Uh, which means I can mortar them. If I have shells. And I do. I do have shells. Uh, let's take the shells out of here because I think they go on the shelf, right? Yeah. Let's, uh... Let's take the shells out of there. Or, I mean, I could put them there, but as a low... Yeah, maybe I should have done that. Mortar shells. But this is going to be, like, low priority. Okay. I think Otis... Are, who Actually, Huntsman, you're probably our best shot, right? Let's quickly take a look at who the best one is uh, for shooting. I think it's the shooting skill. Otis is a 13. Huntsman is a 12, so it's still Otis. But we have we have three mortars. Yeah. Um, man, steel mortar. Huntsman. Man, steel mortar. And who else? Who's our who's our next best? Uh, 13. Um, Boosto is a 10, but. Lopple is an 11. Uh, yeah, let's have Lopple do it. Lopple man this one. And let's make sure these are all using high explosive shell, high explosive, high explosive. And we need to have them all set a target. Actually, we don't want them to have a force target, do we? Um, but it looks like it... This one has what? Stop forced attack. Stop forced attack. Stop forced attack. We might have them forced attack after. Uh, when, once the, if these guys like decide to make camp somewhere first. Oh, it tells you all the weapons they have when you do that now. Look at that. That is excellent. They do have doomsday rockets. Don't we also have doomsday rockets? Come to think of it. Yep. A triple rocket launcher. That is a one-time use. Yes. But we have two of them. It might be worth using on these guys. Huh. Now, they have sniper rifles, though, so it would be hard to get close before we used that. Unless we did it right as they turned a corner or something. We might do that, though. I might have someone do that. Oh, look at that. We're already firing, firing these things. Let's see how we do. Oh, wow. Pretty good. Boom! That was excellent! What a shot! What a shot! We killed... We killed the guy with the Doomsday Rocket Launcher, for one. And it looks like we killed someone else. Someone with a minigun? Everyone's upset. Excellent! Excellent! I think that was Otis. Yeah, that was, that was almost definitely Otis there. Oh, wow. Otis, thank you. Thank you so much. That was beautiful. Look at this. Look at this. The Doomsday Rocket Launcher is ours. Oh, yeah. Oh, my gosh. So good. I'm pretty sure that was Huntsman. We're just killing... Oh, man. Mortars are so good now. I mean, especially when they group before they attack. It's perfect. Nina, you might not survive. Oh, you're, you're not going to survive. Plus, your head is all shredded. Oh, yes. Here it is. All right. Not as good as the other two, but hey. Hard to complain. These guys are so hurt already. Oh, we have uh, Irma down here, too. Yeah, you're, you're all going to die. Uh, I should look to see if anyone has, like, bionics. I guess they don't. Yeah, I would have seen that. That one's just a miss. We definitely need to prioritize making more of these shells. Because we only have, like, 24? Or we did. Now we have less. 
Having three man mortars. Pretty good deal. They do take a long time to fire. But that's fine. I bet we get another good hit. Here we go. Alright. Pretty, pretty bad miss there, but... Here come a couple more. Come on. Oh, here's one. No. That wasn't great either. What was that noise? Oh, someone, uh, someone's shield charged up. That was the, that noise. Oh! Doug created a masterwork animal bed. Oh, I forgot we were making the animal beds. That's right. That's nice. A masterwork one. Beautiful. I guess it's just that we don't create legendary stuff without a mood boost. It does take a really long time for these mortars to hit now, doesn't it? Oh. All right. Well, you did hit. Not as nice as the first two, but... Plus, when these guys bleed out, uh, other people might get upset. Oh, here's another. They're beginning their assault. Okay. But they're pretty darn hurt. Do I want a rocket launch? Kind of. Um... Do I keep launching mortars also? It might be tougher when they're moving. I think we stop manning these mortars, actually. You guys come over here. Um, Doug, come over here. I need someone to flip this switch. Dark Sith, you can do that, please. Okay. Uh, I think I will have Otis try to quickly... How much time do we have here? Grab the Doomsday. I mean, we'll probably be fine. We probably don't need to use it. I might want to save it for a raid. These guys are so hurt already. I don't think I need to use the rocket launcher on them. Yeah. If anything, it'd be, it'd be better to sell them. Alright, so Otis is coming over here. Everyone's coming over here. Otis there. Um... We don't need Bautista or Alvarado. Busto's coming. Oh, no. Busto's not coming. Busto, come over. Uh, Wagner, you might as well. Like, hang out here. Lop. All right. You're coming. Morgan, please come over here. Tara, you're... F um, sure. Trumpet, you might as well. Lumpy, I think you're okay. If we need melee, folks, I don't think we will. Honestly. Um, oh, Huntsman, you don't have a good... Why don't you switch out with Busto? Actually, Morgan, come over here. Huntsman, come there. Good. Actually, Wagner, get behind here. Um, Cleaning dirt. Interesting. Oh, yeah. This is going to go... I think. I have a feeling they're going to run away pretty quickly. Oh! What? Exploded. Because that was awesome. Hold on. They were carrying something. I, I want to see here. Log. Spiky trap. Yeah, yeah you got trapped. Uh... <laughs> Uh, what? Shotgun blast. I heard something exploded and killed a bunch of people. Spike trap. Yeah. A stab wound caught... A stab wound. Yeah, from... Uh, Lopal. Man, these guys are getting destroyed. Otis. Gunshot wound. It sounded like something... Maybe someone threw a grenade. I don't know. Sure seemed like someone... Like, people died because of... Am I just not seeing it? Died because of, uh... Explodey. Oh, here! Lopal's high explosive shell. Oh, no, that was from earlier. Yeah, so I don't know. Yeah, no one's manning those right now. Alright, we got a, a mill. Oh! Okay. Alright, they're fleeing now. We do have a fire. I think this mini turret's gonna be okay, though. Um, you're on fire. You're all on fire. Yeah, you're you're all running the wrong way. You're all idiots. Um, 
I think I might need a melee attacker, actually. Uh, Lumpy, where are you, buddy? Can you, um, help out over here? And you know what, Jesse? You're right there, too. Come over here as well. Um, and, you know, Alvarado, can you put these fires out? That'd be great. I think this will be fine. Jesse, why don't you attack Hammer here? And, uh, Lumpy, attack Yuzuki? I don't want people breaking through wa uh, doors like they did last time. Actually, Lumpy, help with Hammer here. Sophia, are you helping with the fire? No, but can you please? Um, trumpet ticket hit out. Oh. All right. And these guys should take out hammer, no problem. Boy. Okay. Are they all dead? Wow. I think they're all dead dead. Um, Sophia's still playing that. Yeah. Okay. Let's unrestrict everybody. People did flee successfully, but that's okay. I think. Actually, hold on. <gasps> Bionic arm. Um, can we get him? That's the question. Uh, Alvarado, you're good at melee, aren't you? You are. You're pretty good. Um, and you don't have a weapon, I think. Can you get out there in time? I feel like I'm having a little deja vu here. This is maybe a mistake. But. Yeah. Go get Austin if you can. Hope Maybe Austin slowed down enough that we can. I have a feeling we're not going to be able to catch him. But we got to try. We got to try. Um. Yeah, let's unrestrict everybody now. And the animals, also. Um, we can unrestrict our haulers. Including our boars here. Okay. Good. And, yeah, that one's taken care of. These guys did get hit a little bit. A bruise. Bruise cracked. Yeah, you're fine. We got some assault rifles, which is a nice prize. Oh, pave tile. There we go. A very nice prize. Um, yeah, let's undraft everybody. Who else? Wagner. Uh, Alvarado still stays drafted. Um, I think that'll be okay. Oh, you have a joy wire. You know what, let's let's get out um, Otis. Well, let's get out you two. Just come around here, see, we, see if, you, if you can snipe anyone off. Okay. Uh, so if you're, you're, you can also, there you go. And let's uh, do the, use the unforbid claim. Is that it? Is it claim? No, there's an unforbid now. There we go, allow. Allow all of it. Oh, beautiful, I love it. I love it. And you. Oh, we got some Dead Man's Power Armor. And, um, I don't think these people are savable, but maybe we can strip their clothing before they die. I think everyone down here. Oh, no, these guys are alive. Death in two hours, five hours, three hours. Bionic Stomach. Okay. Um, we have to capture you immediately and heal you. Um, who's fast? Uh, is there a way to tell that really quick? No. Who's close by? We have a couple of people coming out here. Sophia. Is it Bl Blondman? 
Sophia. Capture. Good. And the others we need to strip. Let's just take a couple people. Terry. Strip that one. Morgan. Strip that one. Oh, he's someone down here. Yeah, I don't think we're going to try to recruit any of these people. They're almost dead anyway. And I don't think any of them are going to be that amazing. Let's see. Yeah, you can't dump labor. Body purist. Oh, that's like um, you're afraid of bionics. Yeah. Great memory. Bloodlust. You're actually not bad, Blondman, but... Um, no, we're, you're about, we're taking your stomach. <laughs> um, anyone else? Uh, anyone else needs to be stripped? Oh, did we, did we tell someone to strip this bottom person here? Uh, Hercules? I don't know. Fusto, can you do that? And is anyone alive up here? No, I think we brutally murdered everybody up here. Oh, wait, there's someone. Sar. Oh, you know, you're dead in one hour. Well, um, Huntsman, can you quickly strip Sar within the next hour? Yeah, great. Excellent. Oh, we can also turn off our power. Um, do we have someone stripping you? Maybe. Um, Alvarado, did you... You are still going after him. Come on, guys. Helps out here. Yeah, this will be good. Get right there. Although, Alvarado, I'm nervous. Yeah, Alvarado, don't go after him. But if you guys can try to down, specifically aim at the one that has a bionic, and maybe we'll get lucky. Uh, who is it? Uh, you, Austin. Okay. And Alvarado, as long as you're down here, why don't you... Sophia already almost here? Kind of. Wait, what are you doing? Yeah, you are. Let's see. Strip, reserved. Strip, reserved. Uh, no, that you're... No one's stripping you. Strip. Thank you, Alvarado. Okay. Lop will get closer. Doug, get closer. Come on, get lucky. Come on, get lucky. We can do it. Oh, come on. Oh, so close. Mm. Oh. Oh, well. We got close. Maybe we'll get a bionic stomach out of this. We'll be able to make bionics in not too long anyway. It's fine. Um, you guys are stripped. I don't think we need to harvest anything out of y'all. Yeah, you're going to die. You're pro I mean, we could save you. Jealous isn't great. You got good skills, though, but you can't dumb labor, and that's, that's the most important thing for us right now. Okay. I think we're done. I think we're all done here. I got a people bring stuff in. What is that? A oh, flak jacket. Oh. That's nice. Boost, why don't you bring that in? Oh. Oh. Um, really? We can't bring in flak jackets. Because that's a new thing. Apparel. Look at that. Plate armor. Yeah. It's all allowed. I wonder what else. Drugs. Ambrosia is allowed. Psyche T is allowed. Oh, you know what? I think that stuff goes in uh, the fridge. Textiles, though. But not all leather is allowed? Patch leather is allowed now. Yeah, all the new stuff. Items. Yep. These mech serums are allowed. You know, all weapons are allowed. Okay. And I should probably do the same with this area. I will unpause it while I do this. Yeah. It's all allowed. All apparel. All this stuff. 
All weapons. Um, yeah, all body parts. All unfinished. Mortar shells. Yeah, we're saying... Okay, it's fine. Um, and here too, this one. All unfinished, all body parts. Okay, better. Um, Sophia's bringing back the... Uh, the one prisoner? Where, where are you, Sophia? Oh, Doug, what are you doing? Both of you, stop. Um, you could bring something back, though. What is valuable out here? Let's see. Um, oh, I thought we... Oh, now you can haul the flak jacket. Yeah, whoops. And Doug... What are these? Flak pants, yeah. Doug, haul back the flak pants. Good job. Good job, everybody. Well done. Well done. Uh, right, Sophia, all right, you're carrying back, right, it would be nice, let's have a, um, a stockpile zone, let's always keep some medicine in here, I think, uh, yeah, just right there, and I will, because we have enough medicine, Cool. I will keep this as, um, like, this priority is probably, oh, it's important. And this one also. Um, you know what? I will say this should be one up from important. Cool. So this will get medicine after everyone, but then we should have medicine there. In fact, uh, we probably have medicine we can bring there right now, I'm guessing. Um, which might be good, because we need to heal that guy in a hurry. Batista, what are you doing? Researching? That's cool. Uh, where's some medicine I can haul? Also, does Nutrimine go bad? I mean, uh, like, does it need a refrigeration? No, it appears not. But where are oh, there some medicine? Chewy. Actually, I want you over there, so haul that medicine. Good, and you should bring it over here. You should. Okay. That'll be good. So. Oh, it died. Lawnman died while we were hauling him. Or her. Happily nude. Oh, Sophia's happily nude. Yeah, so we didn't get the bionic part. We didn't get any bionic parts, unfortunately. But what are you going to do? We got some We got some stuff. We got flak jackets. Um, we got... I don't think the dead man stuff you can make into patch leather. Although I could be wrong about that. Oh, and a lot of our traps that went off, we're going to have to redo some of that. Okay. Well, let me know... Let me know in the comments if Dead Man stuff can be made into something better. Oops. Wood was crushed. That's okay. Um, I think that's okay. Yeah, it's all fine. Uh, if, yeah, if, uh, if in... 1.0, we can make Dead Man's Leather into patch leather or something like that. Um, but I think successful episode. I enjoyed playing with you today, and I'll see you next time. Bye, everybody.